Welcome back to another video. This video, this video is gonna be really quiet because it's 4 a.m. right now. It just sounded like a shit day, so I'm sorry if I'm pressed up to the mic right now. I'm just speaking pretty quietly. But this, since I don't have time for a Minecraft video or anything, even though I did get Steam working again, so expect another Knights of the Old Republic uh, video. But um, yeah, this is called Snakes on a Cartesian Plane. And it's a flash game so yeah but these are the controls and it's basically snake as you all know just on a, um sorry i'm just so tired right now i just can't like sleep this is on a um this is uh, basically snake with like full physics not physics but um Alright, so we got, like, it's a bunch of different variations of snakes, so, uh, you gotta beat it, like, you gotta beat, like, a ton, ton of very, like, ton of, I'll cut out all the things that aren't, like, funny, so, like, I'm, pro I'm not probably gonna cut this out right now, so if there's a lot of cuts, that's why, so, like, if there's a boring level, like, uh, this one, I'll just cut it out and skill. Yeah, I haven't played this game before, uh, well, I've played Snake before, but I haven't played the specific version of it right now. Well, this is the basic one, yeah, but I haven't played Snakes on a Cartesian Plane. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, it's 4am, so I'm pretty, like, I want to do a, a non-live, uh, commentary. Like, all my commentaries so far have been live, close, Warner Peace. What the heck? I died, but I, t can I go off screen? Nope. So, there's Viper, and then there's Mumushu. This is called Mumushu, and it just, like, leaves an enemy or whatever. I'm pretty sure it's just, like, when, uh, you get a food thing, you can't run into the same, like, ghost of its square again. So, basically, me and friends, we decided to, uh, do this thing called the 48-hour challenge, which is, um... Basically, what it sounds like, you stay up straight for 48 hours. I ended up doing it, and I won some money, like, five bucks, because, I like, there are a couple other people that did it. And even though the pool was, like, 160 bucks, I ended up getting second, because I uh, passed out. My cousins were there, so they all heard, like, were there with me, and they filmed it, and I ended up going, like, crazy towards the end. I'm so bad at this game. <laughs> I'm sorry if you guys are hearing a bunch of, uh clicking in the background that's just my keyboard this shit cray right down left up, down up left crap how am i supposed to do this there we go four i'm so bad i'm sorry i'm so like tired guys it's 4 a.m give me some credit I haven't said this already, I can't remember, but the link to this uh, game, it's a flash game, will be in the description. And I'm, I'm sorry if you guys see a bunch of like ads, like Facebook things in the corner there, like like on Facebook or plus one on Google Plus, because who uses that anymore? Um, yeah, like stuff like that. I'm sorry about that, it's a flash game, so it's stuff like that in the sideways. And I'm too tired to edit it out. And I'm obviously too tired to pay attention also. Whoosh. I'm so tired. This is basically like the worst thing ever I could be doing right now. Why am I doing this? Why? Why am I so good at this game? Once again, it's like 4 a.m. So once again, it is 4 a.m. So can I eat my old food? No, I can't. What just happened? To me? Oh yeah. Why am I so good at this game? Why am I so good at this game? Never mind. All right. So as I was saying, um, 48-hour challenge. Basically, the first night was a breeze, and, uh, it was pretty easy. I just played Mirror's Edge and Uncharted 3. Which, by the way, about Uncharted 3, I want to start, like, replaying, like, not replaying that, but I want to start posting, like, multiplayer games. I just gotta get good at the game. But, yeah, the first night was pretty easy. I had tons of Mountain Dew, so I was, like, had all calf. I had enough calf to stay up. And then, oh crap. He's were there, and he stayed up with me the first night. Then the second night... Like my everyone knew I was doing this in my family, so they were all supporting me. And then my cousins, they wanted to watch the movie, so I, I'm watching the movie with them. And I'm like, guys, I need to play a video game. I need something to help like keep me awake. Because we were watching The Grudge, and like, it, I'm not gonna say it's a boring movie because I really don't remember anything of it. I don't remember anything that night. 
that's like up to where I remember and I was just like guys I need to play a, I need a video game because I needed something to stimulate my mind that like something to actively do am I gonna make this yeah clutch fucking clutch yeah I need a wool cap for some reason and shoving my head into water like ice cold water like they were making me it did help keep me awake and then around uh, 2 a.m. that night, the second night, so about like 43 hours in, like I started like like I started blacking out, like I couldn't remember anything that was going on. And apparently, like they have a video of me of it. Apparently, I started screaming that the girl in the garage was like the mo a girl from my school. And like I started like saying random things, like they I'd pass out, then they'd wake me up, and like I remember there's one thing I said, but I can't remember exactly what it was. So yeah, that's the reason my cousins are responsible for me failing and not me at all. It was extra tiring because the night we planned it on the worst night ever because since it was Thanksgiving, um, crap, was Thanksgiving, um, like you ate a lot, but also we had the turkey trot, so like we had to run like a race the day before, and I did pretty well in that race. I got like 25th for my age group out of like 400 kids. Which is pretty good. It was a 5k, so yeah. Even though I was the oldest, like, age in the old, like, it was like 9 to like 14 or whatever. And I was 14 at the time, so I did have an obvious advantage with. So I did have like an obvious advantage over the other kids because I was like 14 and the others were like 9. But yeah, me and my friends, we did end up like winning most of the first places because, like, me and my cross country teammates, except for this one 12 year old who got like. 15 minutes on it which is like crazy that's like void rage it's so that one kid did really well but that's not the point and i forget exactly where i was going with that i just don't know why i'm so good at this game in this new game i got I, all i had to do was turn on the credits and then just leave it off i can't even speak right now i'm saying good store instead of good score and then i'm playing like i'm I'm saying, playing instead of saying, these move, this could be fun, no, you stay right there, stay, stay, I think I'm gonna do this like a uh, nerd cubed how he does uh, videos, what he does is he like plays them for like three hours straight, and then edits it so there's only like funny jokes in there, oh my god, this thing is so annoying, never, Tell me to remind me to never play this game again. Not this game mode, even though this is like the funnest one so far. Yeah, and this whole thing, it would be a lot funnier if I was playing this during the day and had like a lot of sleep before because I'd be like loud. Unlike now, because once again it's like 4 a.m. so I can't speak loudly or else I'll wake everyone up. Come on, stay there. This thing's like trying to avoid me. Well, yeah, it's the point of the game to make it hard. I'm gonna finish this off now because I'm just way too like tired to do anything. So I'm the electrical runner, guys. Uh, once again, the game is in the description. Come back here. There we go. Once again, the um, game is in the description. Uh, please like or subscribe if you like the video. I don't know really why you would because it's been a boring video. But bye.